Hi everybody. Well, I'm out in the shop. I'm working on a Red Max backpack blower that a customer brought in uh, with a no start problem. And uh, this one's kind of unique, uh, something I actually haven't seen before. Uh, although I have uh, an idea of what caused the problem. Uh, so anyway, uh, what I did was I was checking out the fuel line because I uh, found that it was not getting fuel when I would pump the primer bowl. And when I popped out the grommet for the fuel tank here, I found that both fuel lines were severed right where they go into this grommet. Although the funny thing is, uh, these, these are actually not cut. Uh, so um, the best guess that we've been able to come up with is that there was some sort of an interaction with the fuel, uh, maybe the fuel mixture, uh, and possibly uh, the tightness of this grommet and these two holes uh, against these fuel lines. Uh, and just over time, uh, from having these lines in this grommet uh, and being so tight against the lines and then the interaction with the fuel uh, actually acted to sever the lines right at the grommet. Because uh, you can see uh, just how close uh, the severing was to the top of the tank. Uh, and so what I had to do was uh, fish the old pieces out of the tank so here's the old return line, and here's the old fil uh, fuel filter, so the pickup tube. And they're also, here's the part that got severed. Probably not going to focus real well on that, but. And it looks like on here, it was this edge right there where it severed, slightly on an angle, which matches this one. So, very strange. Uh, now, it's possible uh, that this fuel line uh, had some kind of a bad interaction with the fuel uh, that made it do that, uh, or it could just be because this is so tight. Uh, but I can't imagine that the customer went in there and decided to cut their own lines. Uh, and if somebody did this uh, as a joke, that's eh, a pretty crappy joke, so. Anyway. Uh, new set of fuel lines ought to take care of this, so it's really not that complicated, but uh, curious to see what you think. So if you have any questions or any comments about this, uh, please post them below. And thanks for watching, and if you like my videos, please subscribe.